Howdy guys, I'm back with more Path of Exile, and I guess you can assume what I'm going to be doing uh, today. I was actually running around doing some low-level maps, just trying to clear them out before I started my recording, and well, of course the first map I do that on is a trial I haven't been to. So I've only done Burning Rage, now I'm going to head into Crippling Grief here. Man, these names are just... <laughs> They're interesting. I like the names of these trials. Trials of Crippling Grief. Like, oh boy, I can't wait to go through Crippling Grief. So this is going to be probably absolutely terrible. Uh, based on what you guys have told me, though, the burning, the burning anger, whatever the one I was just in, is the worst. But uh, I see unending lethargy, temporal change. Okay, I guess that can't be killed, can it? Oh, it can be. Alright, alright. So we got two locked doors here at the beginning and a little spinny saw thing. But having this um, lightning warp is going to, I think, make this a little bit easier to get around for sure. There we go. Yeah, that was, this isn't uh, going too bad at all for now. I know this is all very subject to change. Oh, 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 oh. Especially when I see this, um, uh, these spike traps up here. Yeah, this is going to be a barrel of monkeys for sure. Alright, let's... Alright, I'm going to go now. And, oh gosh, spikes everywhere. Thankfully these don't look like the timed cranks, so that's really, really good for me, I think. I hate... Oh gosh, I hate those timed ones. Those are the worst. Alright, oh, I'm going to get buzzed. Alright. <laughs> Alright, I need to take a second here. Let my energy shield recharge. Oh boy. Yeah, so, um... Oh gosh, I'm so bad at these things. Oh gosh, oh gosh. Alright, so these saws come back pretty fast. Can I, can I, can I, can I? Oh gosh, I should have, um, what do you call it? Faster cast speed on my lightning warp. I don't have it. Uh, for, just because I, no real reason, honestly. Just because I'm a bad, basically. I probably should have that for lightning warp. Alright, we've got two levers which opened this door. And now I can go through here, which is just exactly what I want. Oh, 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 almost died there. Here we go. Alright, so what are these? Let's see. Endless hazard. Enemies take damage when using movement skills. So, since this is a teleport, is that considered a movement skill? I assume it's not, but I've been wrong before, right? Alright, let's... Oh jeez, this is this is terrible. <laughs> oh, 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 oops, oops, I didn't mean to do that. Oh gosh, I'm panicking, I'm panicking. Alright, alright, I can, I'm just, yeah, there we go. No need to panic, these don't do all that much damage. <laughs> Oi, so, um, I'm not really doing anything too terribly different. I have changed it up a little bit, um, just because I'm still trying to figure it all out, you know, um... You know, I I dropped one of my auras, and I also dropped, uh, gosh, Mind Over Matter, or, oops, in the passive tree, because the build thing that I was looking at didn't have that. So I had a lot of mana that I wasn't really using, because my totems don't really cost a whole lot. Oh, jeez. 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 Okay, here we go. <laughs> that was really bad. All of it was bad. Oh, Oh, okay, I can go up here. I'm like, what the heck, where do I go? But there's a stairway up here. So I picked up a new aura called Haste. Now, Haste is probably taking up too much of my reserve mana, so I might not keep it. But like I said, I'm just trying to try out a few new things. Not really sure what's exactly going to be good for me. I'm just running through these to hell with it. <laughs> um, one of the comments uh, uh, says that maybe the Scorching ray thing that I have probably isn't the best ability because Righteous Fire is just so awesome, but I thought it was nice because of the debuff. I'm not, I guess it's not as, oh gosh, I guess maybe it's not as good as I thought, but I'm really not sure what I should use instead or if I should even use anything or maybe a different movement ability or something else, utility and just use the Righteous Fire stuff. I'm not really sure. Okay, I need to get up to that lever is what I need to do, so is there. Here we go, stairs. Alright, this, I do gotta say, is nowhere near as bad as the, um, famous last words. <laughs> nowhere near as annoying as the fire one with the, the fire, oh, 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 I'm getting careless, I'm getting careless, I'm getting careless. Alright, the fire one was 
bad though because uh, all the cranks were timed so I had to make a mad dash and then there were just endless mobs spawning so that one was really the burning one that I did before was really really hard but this one's not so bad so far and like I said I think a lot of it is there's not really a whole lot of mobs and there's also um, uh, you know, no timed cranks, so it's definitely feeling a lot easier. But yeah, if I if I drop a Scorching Ray, which I do kind of like it, but if it's not really good for me, it's not good for me. Um, I'm not really sure what I would uh, want to replace it with. I tried looking through some abilities, and I just drew a blank, basically. So, oh my gosh, I don't want to be here. I don't want to be here. I don't want to be here. Oh my gosh, I don't... Whoa, 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 that was bad. <laughs> What, did it, what was I saying about this place not being so bad? Alright, I don't know what that lever opened, to be perfectly honest. Ah! Alright, so let's... These are going slow. I can make my way through these. And I got impaled. And I got impaled. And I got thawed. And I'm gonna get impaled! I'm gonna die! I'm gonna die! I'm gonna die! Oh my god! 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 That was me panicking. I suck! Oh my gosh! Well, good thing I just leveled. <laughs> so it wasn't uh, a bad experience lost, thank goodness. But that was really stupid and that didn't need to happen. I was I was panicking and I don't do deal good or I don't do good with panic. Sorry guys. And Oh, he's still trying my best not to have a complete freak out when something happens, but you can, guys can pretty much see how that's... I'm about to run in here and die all over again because I'm being careless. Alright. Alright, here we go. Oh gosh, that was stupid of me. Yeah, I think I definitely want to put a faster casting support on Lightning Warp for sure, especially when I'm doing stuff like this. Uh, jeez, yeah, I, I'm gonna have to do that for sure. Golems. Really? Really, golems? Really? M making me... Oh, you golems are upsetting me. You're upsetting me. Alright. <laughs> I'm upsetting myself. Alright, so how far did I get? I was over in... Uh, and over here imp and impaling myself land here. Alright, I need to be smarter about this. And not just running through screaming my head off like a bozo. That's what I need to do. Alright, so I think... Do I go through here? Um, hmm. Alright, yeah, this this looks like the right way. Alright, so I got things over here on my left and right and center. I don't... Did I go over here on my left? I'm not sure if I went over here and made sure there was nothing. And Alright. Oh, yeah, this... I'm gonna die again. Okay, I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. I have... Uh, I have no way to recharge my flasks, so I've got to be more careful with them. That's what it is. There's not as many mobs, so I can't run carelessly through everything. Alright, so... And I have two health flasks now, too. Alright, I'm very sorry, guys. This is actually harder than the... I, th I was in here saying it wasn't so bad. Now I've died more times than the burning one. I think it's because I got complacent, and I'm like, Oh, this isn't so bad. And I started just, you know, doing this right here, where I'm running through everything, and stomping all my flasks and then I don't end and I end up not having any. Alright, I am not doing well with this. I'm very sorry guys. Alright, let me Alright, this is where it gets ridiculous. I wish I could go another way. <laughs> it wasn't as bad at first when it was all manageable. Now it's too much. Alright, it's much too much. Alright, here we go. Alright, enemies are affected by temporal chains. Alright, so let's uh jeez. Hold on I don't think I'm Oh, alright. I don't think I'm ready for this. Alright, there we go. Alright, so this is where it gets interesting, just past here. Oh gosh, I'm, I'm a bad. Alright, this is where I'm having a hard time, right up here. Alright, so I've been to the left. Uh, gosh, I, I really don't know. Alright, looks like... Something's the way out, maybe, is right there, but there's probably more. There's a lever there, so I know I need to go to the left for sure. Alright, let's do this carefully. I'm gonna wait on them. I'm gonna wait on them. Alright, now I'm gonna go. And can I. Oh, I got impaled. Oh, gosh. Alright, 
Oh gosh, oh gosh. Alright, see, I'm doing it again. I'm panicking. I gotta get this stupid bleeding totem thing down. Alright, now I'm over here. What do I do now? Alright, let's... Can I lightning warp over here-ish? Alright, here we go. Lever. Ah, oh, progress. Progress has been made, guys. Aren't you proud of me? <laughs> I know you're not, you're just sitting here, I know all of you are just sitting here shaking your heads like this girl is hopeless. <laughs> alright, alright, I'm dead, I'm dead, I'm dead, I'm dead, I'm dead, I'm dead. <laughs> I'm all out of flask charges because I keep overzealously smashing the button. Alright, let's get over here. Okay, I want to kill that. Alright, this one, and over here, and kill this, and try not to, I'm probably going to die going for whatever's over here. Ah! There's nothing over here! Okay, I've already... Alright, there's... Uh, that, that. Okay, there maybe was something over there. I'm, I don't I don't remember where I've been in this place, guys. I'm really sorry. I'm having a... Alright, this one isn't easier. I thought it was easier, and it's not. I'm having a really rough time. Uh, I guess the fl endless flow of mobs from burning grief was... Ah! It was actually pretty nice, because I could keep... Ah, uh, whatever. I could just keep refilling my flasks over and over again instead of doing that. I don't know, do, does killing these refill? I don't know, I couldn't tell. Um, because maybe that's a good way to refill the flask charges. Alright, those are gonna buzz me for a little bit. Ooh, hear me try killing... Ah! Killing that. Kill that. Alright. Now I need to get through this part. This... So, do all the trials have the same layout, basically? I mean, I understand that, like, they're all going to have the same traps, but I'm just wondering if they all have the same layout. Because, wow, I'm so bad. Okay. <laughs> Alright, so I think when I get past this spot here... Here we go. I think I just need to go... Oh, there's all the mobs! Alright, so this was opened up. I... Basically, when I went to the right, there was no reason for me to go to the right, and I killed myself. Alright, let's get over here, and, oh gosh, run over here and give everybody a high five. And... Touch this. Line between consideration and hesitation. The former is wisdom. The latter is <laughs> Consideration and fear. Yeah, um... A lot of fear there, Izaro. A lot of fear there. Alright, well, I got that horrible amount of horribleness done. I'm gonna go check the plaque just in case. Alright, Crippling Grief, Burning Rage. Awesome. So those are done. So, and I'm already done with this map, so I'm gonna go ahead and leave. And, um, Glad you made it back, Exile. Okay, so there, uh, there's my second offering to the goddess. Very, very happy that I got that. Now, I don't have any tier 8 maps to run for you guys. I only have, this is my highest one, which, and I haven't been to uh, this area yet, the Arachnid Tomb. So, uh, physical damage reduction, which is fine. I don't do physical damage. Extra damage is lightning. That might be scary. Unique boss has more life. Unique boss has more area of effect. And reduced flask charges, which is really bad for me. Because I like to stomp them carelessly, as you guys have seen. So I'm going to go ahead and hit that thing. And... <laughs> in I go. I spent a l I finally got... I feel oh. your every move. Your every breath. With a million little wires. Uh oh. So I finally um, got my large hideout to the uh, biggest one or whatever. So I've got all the masters in my hideout now. Very, very happy to finally have done that. It only took me, you know, three weeks before the end of the season or two weeks now, at the, basically at this point. So I've got that going on, which is awesome, I personally think. Um, so I spent way longer than I probably should have rearranging my layouts of my the layout of my hideout. So uh, I'd have a cool little spot for all of my all my um, all my master friends. So yeah, I got Katarina to level seven. Haku is almost seven, and everyone. I even got Farisi to level five. I actually managed to pull off some of his enough of his missions to get get him to a decentish level. So, um, that's, that's what's going on in my little hideout. I'm pretty happy about that. Uh, next time I 
make a character for Path of Exile, I'm definitely not going to lollygag around on doing my dailies because having the having the largest hideout is pretty cool and it was pretty fun to decorate. Very very peaceful, calming. Didn't make me feel like a complete idiot like this like doing all this stuff does. Oh, I thought those were linked. I was about to say, oh, but no, it wasn't. So. Boy, looks like they uh, released more information over the about the damage over. Oh gosh, I hate these mobs so much. They always kick my butt. These types, these miscreations that sit there and machine gun fire you into the ground. They always kick my butt. But um, looks like they're changing or they they're ex tried explaining. Okay, 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 Katarina. It's like they're trying to redo the uh, dots, and I'm thinking, like, I don't know if it's just me, but I feel like this is the third time they've, like, explained that on the on their on their announcements, so I'm not sure if that's them changing it over and over again, but I, it, that stuff was way over my head, so it, it sounds like it's basically a nerf to damage over time, so you can't do the whole double dipping anymore, but... I, I don't really get how it works. It's like there's... Yeah, I'm sorry. I can't even speculate how it works. I was trying to understand and I was like, eh, I don't get it. I'll just assume that... Oh, good. All right, You're here, not here. dead. My sculpture complains that it is... Dusty. Okay, so she wants me to revive a... All right, revive this. All right. Revive a corrupted corpse. Done it. And feed souls. Okay, I don't think I've gotten this one. This is... Ooh, oh, oh, Jesus. What happened? <laughs> <laughs> I walked over there and I wasn't even ready for that. What the hell? I just exploded. My gosh, you guys are watching me die over and over again. I feel terrible. I'm so sorry, guys. I, you know, I'm sitting here running all this stuff off camera, you know, willy nilly, no problems. And then as soon as I start recording, it's like the full f force of my, yeah, in fact, I probably, well, I guess I didn't have a lot, but the full f force of my derping ability becomes apparent. Um,. <laughs> Oi, I I see what what you guys mean with the deaths because these these do kind of hurt. It, uh, I'm very glad I decided. <clears throat> excuse me. I'm very glad I decided to die over and over again after I leveled up. <clears throat> excuse me. <clears throat> I don't know what's going on with my throat. I don't think I've had enough coffee this morning. But um, yeah. Sorry about the repeated deaths there. So, do oh can I not? Oh no. Is is my little minion dude still alive over here? Alright, so I'm gonna stay much further back over here, put down my decoy totem- Oh! Oh, something's getting me again! Get out of there! Get out of there! Alright, I'm in a little- Oi, there we go. I got kind of hung up on this corner there. Alright, clear my curses. Moving along. That, uh, okay, so we got some big looking bads here. Need to actually go in here, not act like an idiot, use my curses, use my potions. Oh gosh, something is really I need more mana. Oh, well, that's the first time I've heard of me complaining about mana. All right, so I guess this thing has enough souls. It says to return to Katarina there. So, boy, that was a lot of screwing up. We do this in the name of art. Indeed, yes. Yeah, see, look, I just got her to level seven. So, pretty awesome. I'm, like I said, enjoying my hideout for sure. Oh, Jesus, that's a lot of... No, I don't really like this area. I hate these mob types. Like, these are the worst for me. Those things, these naked women that just machine gun fire at you. They're such a pain in the butt. All right, so I have a prophecy for uh, one of the... Yeah, in a long lost dream, great foes hide in tiny boxes. Okay, so it's probably not... It says a tiny box. I don't know. I'm kind of scared that this might be it. Oh! Well, that's my backup plan in case things go bad. All right, so casts firestorm random curse. I need items. All right, so not too worried about the curse because I can just go ahead and be immune to curses right now. There we go. And I'm gonna just back up over here and get this guy. Oh, he's they just gonna keep coming and coming and coming through my curses and ooh rarity of items. I guess if I really wanted to go nuts with the rarity of items. Alright, so that was nothing. <laughs> Down the stairs I go here. Man, this is really a creepy looking area with all the cobwebs and stuff. Man, oh man. I like it. 
Oi, so yeah, the, uh, like I said, they talked a bit more about the damage over time changes. I don't know what GGG's track record is with, like, nerfing and buffing abilities. You know some uh, game developers, uh, gosh, when they nerf something, they nerf the hell out of it to the point that it's useless, or if they change something, they change in such a way that it's just very hard to understand or figure out or work around, so I'm really curious to see how GGG makes nerfs and changes. And, you know, I, I have confidence in them because they're gamers too, right? And they just want to make things not overpowered, but balanced and fun, right? They're not, they're not just they're not a bunch of people that don't know what they're doing, right? They know what they're doing, so I feel like whatever they changes... Oops. Oops. Alright, hold on. Where am I? <laughs> Alright, here we go. I feel like whatever changes they make will probably be overall good changes for us, but I don't know, because I haven't played enough, so I don't really want to judge. I'm just assuming they, they, they're going to do us good. Oh, jeez. Alright, clear that. Oh, man. I just probably overlap. Alright, there we go. I got a shore map. Alright, tier 8. With only, unfortunately, it's blue quality. Ooh, that might be good. Alright, so... It says more than 50 monsters remain, and... Hmm. But I did finish the map. Oh gosh, where am I? Here I am. So I did finish it. Hmm. I should probably... I should probably find some more monsters to clear out though just because I did lose a lot of experience and uh, one of you guys were telling me that the map drops do become a bit more rare and uh, yeah so I should probably do or try I I'm not gonna like run around all over the place trying to find stuff but if I can find you know a few more good packs of mobs I don't actually even you know what closer. I don't want to be here I don't like the mobs in this place. They're kicking my butt. Forget it. I'm not going to stick around, even if I should clear that play. Oh, that's not it. Alright, nothing good, nothing good, nothing good, nothing good. Ooh, okay, so immunity to shock removes shock. Okay, so that's actually one of the ones you guys were telling me would be good, because I'm using... Um, this right here that gives life recovery to my minions, which I can just resummon them, whatever. So I'm going to actually swap that in. Um, I don't think I've really had a whole bunch of things shocking me, but maybe I haven't been paying attention, so, and maybe I have. <laughs> so uh, let me. Oh gosh, everything's a mess. Okay, I'm just gonna. Yeah, I'm just gonna unload this right now, so you guys don't have to sit here and watch me being a buffoon with my inventory here. Okay, so... Oh, I don't know. I, I'm obsessed with clicking on the portal scroll today. So... Alright, so it has to be a normal item in order to upgrade it. So I would really like to do a yellow quality tier 8 Learn anything new. map and not a blue quality though is the thing. And our girl here Stay doesn't safe. have anything. Hmm... Yeah, I all and all I have are lower level maps. Oi, yeah. Okay, so I think I'm just going to have to do a blue quality and this one is players gain 40% reduced flask charges. That sucks, but I'm not going to um reforge it or anything because from what I've learned it can always be much worse. <laughs> I mean, like I don't really know if <clears throat> Like, if I'm at the point where it's really worth using, like, any of my items or anything. So I'm just gonna... I figure when I get to, like, level 80, I can worry more about that kind of stuff. So I just need to practice with the maps right now. So even though I won't get a complete for this one, I think I'm gonna go ahead and give it a whirl. Because it's my first tier 8 map. Just want to see what a how much of a challenge it is. That last one was. Each life, each act, as fleeting as footprints in the sand. Oh, so monsters here are level seventy-five. So this is probably at the point where it's going to start being a bit of a challenge for me. So going to make sure I go through here pretty slowly, pretty thoroughly. I really want to make sure I get some yellow quality good maps for. Um, 
what's coming up, you know, so I can finish them and move along and so forth. So let's go ahead and do that. But yeah, if uh, Scorching Ray's no good, guys, I mean, I know a lot of you have a lot of different suggestions and I'm very slow and I haven't adapted them all yet. Uh, I know one of you's been asking me to get one of those, um, Sire of Shards, I think it was called, it was a, is, I think it's a wand, but I have, I just honestly haven't been doing any trading or anything. I'm still using the same equipment that I've had for several, several levels, and I'm, I'm, I don't know why I'm just being so weird about not trading right now. I just need to do it, but I don't know. I'm having, I like, I feel like I'm being successful for what I, with what I have for the most part. Ooh, catacombs. There we go. I can reroll that into a yellow quality at least. Ooh, there we go. So much for maps being rare drops. <laughs> Getting a few of them now. This is awesome. Alright, so let's do... Okay, oh, it's only a tier 3 one though. Bummer. I don't, I don't know all the maps and their quality. Oh my gosh, four or three maps in a row. This is awesome. All right, I'm liking this place, getting all kinds of goodies. Oh my gosh, <laughs> I'm on a roll. Do you see all these maps I'm getting? I'm on a complete roll. This is great. Okay, right, let's grab that. Oh my gosh. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, I'm going to need a counter for all these map drops. This is awesome. Alright, I'm really liking this place and the, and the drops so far. I'm off to a pretty good start in this place, I gotta say. Alright. No noble claw. Alright. Like I said, I'm going to try to actually go through this. Open oh, up no, nothing over there. So this is a pretty... I like this area. This seems pretty easy to get around. It's nice and open. Not a whole bunch of choke points for me to, you know, get trapped by mobs. Ooh! And I like the mob types so far. The skeletons are, you know, always pretty okay to deal with. You know, you don't have those machine gun naked ladies from the... I'm sorry I'm terrible with the mob names, but those machine gun naked ladies were terrible. I need to get this guy over here. Alright, get this, get this. Alright, got them all. Alright, let's open this. Alright, I'm about to run out of inventory space here. Alright, let me check out what I got real fast. Uh, nah, nah. Oh, I'm keeping that because it's multicolored, right? Alright, so I'm gonna dump these. They're not very good. Oh, that, I wanna keep that. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Alright, let's grab this, see if it's any good. Uh, huh, that might be okay. I'll hang on to that. Alright, a corpse. I can kick it. Kick the corpse. Alright, let's go ahead and open this bad boy up. A curse and rare items. Not bad, I like rare items. And now I'm immune to curses, so go ahead and hit me with that curse. <laughs> Alright, ooh. This might be good. Let's check that out. The shield. Let's see. 22 cold resist, lightning resist, chaos resist. That might be okay. I like the... Like I said, I'm not sure. I feel like chaos resistance is... I don't know if I'm... When that's going to be important. Or if it's going to be important for me to grab. Because, um... I have negative 33 chaos resistance. I have, like, no chaos resist... Ah! Stuff. But it does seem like it's kind of rare, but I don't know I, if uh, if that, that's probably something I need to fix or not. Uh, I assume it's something I want to fix. I've been trying to hang, <clears throat> hang on to anything with chaos resistance, and if I find out I need... I don't feel like I've really needed it a whole lot, but to be perfectly honest, I don't always know what I'm dying to. So I kind of feel like I don't really need chaos resistance. I just walked right past this guy. <laughs> um, but maybe I'm wrong. Maybe I do. I don't know. Oh my gosh, these guys just aren't dying. Let me put a... There we go. There we go. Pirate Lord's Treasure. Cool. Oh, it was a trap! It was a trap! Arg. Okay. Well, that was cool. Got some boots, got some gloves, got a full-ass inventory, so I can't... Yeah, I'm gonna... Let's see if these are any good. No, and maybe this one. Let's see. Uh, no, I'll probably pick the, up those. Those were... Uh, no, you know, I'm not really gonna use any of this, so whatever. I'm just gonna pick these up and move along. I've been using a lot more of these scrolls of wisdom. I feel like they're more of a rare commodity than they used to be. I don't know, but these look good. They're four slots. 
Um, cold resistance, evasion, eh. I'll hang on to him, whatever. Orb of augmentation, alright. I don't know if I should, like, you know, I'm just not sure if I should be running back to town, vendoring, unloading all my equipment, because I have only so many times I can enter these, uh, maps, and, I mean, you, oh, there's my, oh, timer. Um, and you guys, you watch me play, you see how much of an idiot I am. I, I do all kinds of stupid stuff. I die all the time. I just, I'm, s <gasps> speaking of which, <laughs> you know, I'm, I'm still not very good mechanically at the game, and it's going to be a while till I am, so I still do a lot of really stupid stuff, so I don't really want to um, use all my return portals from just bringing back gear. I mean, I know that's kind of the point, but... Oh, what is this? Memory of home, huh? Okay, hold on, I want to actually look at this, and the sea of monsters will never freaking stop. So I'm going to go over here. Alright, nothing's over here. Is there anything over here? Yes, there is. I'm going to go and clear everything out of this area so that I can check this out without interruption. That means you guys over here. Leave me alone. Okay, so now I want to check out this memory of home. I'm going to put totem sentries in case anything comes <laughs> and I'm gonna check this out memory of home the rays have become an almost nightly occurrence the neighborhood is changing Septimus and his family have not been seen for a week and I fear the rumors of the high Templar's secret trials and exiles may be true high Templar Venarius is far more puritanical than even Vol and has been vigilantly tracking down, destroying important historical texts and artifacts that he deems heretical. It seems as though he's also getting rid of those who own such items. He doesn't see Still that without sane, history there is no progress, or he just doesn't care. I'm not sure which is more dangerous. I can't in good conscience let important information simply vanish. I have a responsibility to my family and to the world. To ensure that the boundaries of knowledge are pushed ever forward, no matter the risk. Hmm. As I left the academy this morning, blurry-eyed and sleepless, my daughter followed me again. I tucked her back in bed and kissed her goodbye. I worry about the world she will grow up in. There's a chance that I might survive living in exile, but she... She is still just a child. She <gasps> needs me. Oh. I will have to be careful. Huh. Interesting. 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 A child. Hmm. 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 And it just so happens I have someone with me that can seem to just manipulate the maps and everything else. Is that a coincidence, I wonder? I don't know. Hmm. Looks like she's got something new to say. This is fantastic, Exile. Look for more of these memory fragments. I have a hunch they may lead us directly to him, or at least help us figure out his identity and his weaknesses. Hmm. Good luck with your maps. Hmm. Hmm. I'm hmm over here. I'm wondering things. That cloaked thing. It's out there in the atlas, carefully shaping life into the monstrosities we now see. And it's got the potential to spill out into our home. We need to put a stop to it. Head out there and see what you can find. There's a horde of corrupted horrors out there, and they're starting to... Okay, so I'm just doing another one of her little uh, missions, which of course I'm going to do because they're Hoy's awesome experience. Vibrant colors dash across the gray, consuming Ooh. man's world. Oh, wow, this is pretty... Oh, I have a... Oh, 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 wow. Okay, I have a time limit. Wow. A pain spirit hijacks a body. And will not be stopped by their body's demise. Oh gosh, I have a I have a time limit. Hold on. Oh, okay. Let me just walk over here and give everyone a high five. All right. Slay the corrupted monsters. Oh, oh. Here's the standing stones. Okay, okay. That's how. That's what these are. So these give me additional time. Ooh, nifty. Okay, okay. I see. I see. This is cool. I'm gonna have to go back and pick up that treasure after I'm done with this. Um, oh, jeez. Okay, I didn't... 
Oh gosh, I don't, you know, I'm not gonna, oh gosh, I'm not gonna lie, I'm pretty panicked to get this done quickly. Oh gosh, and alright, another one of these. This is such a pretty area, I love this. It's like the hedge maze or whatever. Alright, oh jeez, I'm dead, I'm dead, I'm dead, I'm dead, I'm dead. <laughs> I need to stop walking into everything, but the timers make me nervous. I hate timers! I hate timers! Stop! Stop spawning monsters! Oh my gosh, and then I'm in a little, I'm in a little tiny area with nowhere to move. I, this is the worst. Not only do I have a timer, it's in a little, lot of areas with tight spots and lots and lots of monsters. Lots and lots of monsters. Ooh, a thicket map. Oh, but I only have three minutes left. I don't care, I want it. Alright, there we go. Uh, nothing over here. Crap. Okay, maybe this way. Okay, there's some monsters over here. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. This is bad. I'm, I'm gonna end up running out of time, I think, because I'm the slowest person in the planet that plays this game. There's no one else that plays this game slower than me. I am the absolute slowest person to have ever played this game. <laughs> Sorry, I'm just freaking out a little bit. I'm trying to... Oh, gosh. Where... What? What? Where are the corrupted monsters? Am I going the wrong way? I'm. I. There's tons and tons of them, but none of them are corrupted. I feel like I've gone the wrong way. Oh man, there's nothing even over here. I'm gonna end up clearing out this whole place trying to find what the hell I'm supposed to kill. Oh, I'm gonna die too, probably. Oi. All right, kill these guys. Okay, here we go. Here's something up here, up here, over here. There, here it is. Okay. Oh, it's another standing stone. Okay, that's good. I need those. Alright. I've got like a million curses on me because I'm spamming my totems before they can even do anything. Man, I'm leaving so many good things. Well, I don't know if they're good or not, but I'm leaving a lot of things behind because I'm just trying to hurry through here. Okay, I see something up here. I see something. Alright, these are it. I found them. They're over here. Alright, I've got two minutes to clear them, so I've got the time. I think I'm going to be okay, guys. I think I'm going to be alright. Oh, ooh, catacombs. Alright. Oh, jeez. Okay, 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 okay. Oh, there's more over here. There's way... Oh, ooh, a, a unique item. I gotta... gotta if I gotta... If I'm going to die, I'm going to pick that up. <laughs> alright, I gotta get these guys. Oh, my gosh. This is terrible. Look how many there are. My map is... All, or my mini map's completely red with all these corrupted monsters. I only have to kill ten more, five more. Alright, so I've got most of them. Oh jeez, oh jeez, oh jeez. Okay, I need to kill two more. Alright, is this is a stone. Okay, so they were back where I was. Orb of fusing, yes please. I need those badly. <laughs> Alright, I gotta run down here and get two more. Just two more. Here they are, over here. Woo! Oh, Oh, come on! Where's the last one? I'm missing one! I'm missing one! Where's the last one? Is this you? You bugger hiding? My gosh, how rude! Alright, oh gosh, I almost died here at the end. How embarrassing would that be? Alrighty, guys. I'm gonna run around picking up the treasures that I missed, but before I do, I'll ID this item. A Twilight Blade. Let's see. Um... Additional block chance while dual wielding. Increased physical damage with weapons per red socket. Attack speed per green socket. And leech per blue socket. And two melee weapon range per white socket. What the heck? This sounds like a really goofy item. I don't even know if that's any good or not because I'm not a melee. I've never played a melee person so I can't tell if something's good or not. Oh, alrighty guys, so I'm going to probably just walk around here and finish picking up any cool treasure I see, and um, I'll probably, yeah, I'm going to go ahead and be done because there's not going to be anything too much more exciting, you know, the map that I'm doing is not even a um, yellow quality map. Uh, so it's not going to be terribly exciting, and I've already been playing for a little over 30 minutes, so not sure how much more you guys would want to see of this fail terrain over here, so I'm just going to clear this place out, maybe do a few more low-level maps, and maybe uh, tomorrow I can actually do uh, a tier 8 yellow quality map for you guys, or something even better, I don't know, but... 
Anyways, guys, um, let me know what you think about this whole scorching ray. If I if I drop it, what should I drop it for? If I'm just gonna use righteous fire and searing bond, um, and as far as my passive tree, this is what I have going on. I just finished uh, filling out most of this. Um, really need to get that jewel so I can get like another totem life jewel. So th that's what's going on with my passive tree. Um, you know, I'm approaching level 80 here, so I'm level 78 right now, so I'm not going to probably be able to put too many more points around my tree, so I'm probably just going to be looking at filling up stuff that's pretty close to what I already have. Um, so, uh, which, you know, what? Uh, will you die already? Like, why are you running around? Oh my gosh, I swear I don't even know where these monsters come from. I swear they just crawl out of the ground willy-nilly. There, leave me alone. <laughs> so, um, you know, a lot of the builds that I was looking at for totem builds, they weren't for Righteous Fire, they were for a different type of totem, but they started going toward this way, and I don't really think... Or, well, no, yeah, they, they started going toward all of this over here, and I'm not really sure if there's any real reason for me to go this way. I mean, I do use curses, so maybe that some of this stuff might be good, or going over here for the life might be really nice. I mean, this is all life stuff, so if I'm going to get that jewel, you know, if I go boop, 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 I could grab that life, or I could go down over... Um, over toward here and get some of this. I don't really know at this point. I don't have many refund points left because I just did a pretty decent overhaul on my on my tree after defeating Malachi, but this is what's going on right now. I don't know if this is the best. I've got um you know, I've got this in my in my jewels, you know, mostly for the totem life and the um well, clearly the attack speed with mace is obviously <laughs> for when I get my clay shapers back, right? <laughs> I'm joking. But, um, yeah, that's that's basically what's going on right now. Nothing too terribly exciting, so that'll be it for now. Thank you guys so much for watching me play Path of Exile, and I'll see you with another episode very soon. Thank you guys so much for your continued support after how many episodes, 60-something episodes, you guys are still helping me learn, still trying to teach me things, and I really do appreciate you guys. Anyways, thanks again, and bye for now.